Once again, we arrive. I brought this piece of poopy sand with me. Because he insisted. I tried to leave him home. He tried to eat the dog. So I have to bring him with me when I try to do this. No, Michael, you are not looking fancy. Oh, okay, you know, Michael's trying. He combed this goddamn hair over. He looks like Vince Gill resurgence at the Vegas show. Now he just looks like Christopher Walken post cocaine, which we all have those days. Now you look like you want to be a part of the uh, Green Day resurgence. So we got a package. I can't show you guys. I got them address because I don't want you sick of fat fighting him. Huh? Him? Him? Whatever. It's from Diane. Dirty Diana. Oh. Dirty Diana. Oh. It's a great song. By a Christian. Michael Jackson. Love children. So. Let's open this, Mikey. You will not be arriving with these clippers today. I will open. No, Michael, you almost got. It smells like ass. Get off. You picked your ass before this thing again. I watched you like a goddamn Harambe in the corner, picking butts and smelling fingers. So, oh, this is oh, very nice wrapping, Diane. You're not so dirty, Diane, after all. I like it, though. Give me a moment. Okay, this is our letter, Michael. It's for me and you. Michael hasn't spoken in goddamn since Christ was alive, so I'm gonna read for us. Dear Dr. Loomis and Michael, if I feel your fingers one more time on me bum, I will put your fingers in Bill Cosby's Cotillia. That's a drink. Dear Dr. Loomis and Mike, I hope this letter finds you both happy and healthy. Well, you know, I drink a lot, but I'm doing okay. Michael, not so much. Well, as happy and healthy as you, as a serial killer and his psychiatrist can be this close to Halloween. You got them right, Diane. I am stressed all out. I got three gray hairs that just sprung up and my Xanax is low. Michael needs more thorns in his butt chick and times are tight. So I've resorted to Sour Patch Kids. First the sour, or first the sweet, I don't know how it goes, Michael. Get off. Anyway, the letter continues. I got Michael some candy as he waits for Halloween, so he'll not get too cranky, and just in case he enjoys football, the candy corn is perfect as well. Michael does like football. He likes the way they crash into each other, the tights the players wear. The way that the quarterback goes hut hike, he likes all of it. Like Tecmo Super Bowl. Michael Myers is on top of it. And Michael, I get, oh she says, and Michael, I too get cranky without my candy corn. Wink. What are you saying, Dirty Diane? Off of it. Michael, you look crazy as shit. You look like Gary Busey looking for his last drink. So, she continues. I got the distinct feeling that you, Dr. Limus, was not so thrilled with my I Heart Mike. I was not, but you know, you do what you do. It was a mug she sent me. It was not my Asian tea. So I decided some Asian tea might soften any hard feelings and give you the eye of the tiger to help you cope with Michael. What have you done? I only sent the mug in hopes to bring a smile and a chuckle to you. You're just so intense. I don't get that, Michael. What are you doing? Are you posing for People Magazine, Playing Girl? What are you doing? Southern Living. I love you, Dr. Lumis, and would never want to make you upset with me. Well, Diane, I am not because of this letter. I appreciate it a lot. So, I, I'm gonna keep reading, Michael. You calm down and stop posing for the camera like you're George Michael Resurgent. Are you going back in time? 1.21 gigawatts to shit? Stop! Dr. Loomis, you have helped me. 
Once when I had to get an injection in my tailbone, I kept imagining you yelling at me to breathe during the procedure. Yes! Yes! Don't worry about that needle! It goes in and it goes out! You're gonna be okay! And then there's Asian tea for you after! Michael agrees. Also, you and Michael's antics will often pull me back from the edge of the proverbial cliff. Proverbial cliff. Michael's stressed me so I can't even read this goddamn thing sometimes. Let me tell you something, Diane. If this piece of shit has helped you in any way whatsoever, other than making sure you never adopt from the Strode Realty Foundation, we appreciate it. Oh, shoot, okay. I have a couple of questions for you, Dr. Loomis. What do you do for fun? Well, there's a lot of things I like to do for fun myself. Uh, there's Tetris. I know it's a new popular game with the children. Uh, I like to Sudoku, even though I'm not so good with the numbers. And then also, as a matter of fact, I like to go and peruse Bed Bath & Beyond in October. See what they have to, available. I like the soaps. I hope it's something naughty since I did simply do you. Well, I mean, I'm sorry I disappoint. I mean, nobody knows about that time I went to Hustler. I have had dreams of being rescued by you from unseen dangers. What does this dream mean? Well, goddamn, stay out of danger. I mean, if you're in danger, you stay the fuck awake. Michael's heroin is laying off. If you are in unseen dangers, don't be in unseen dangers. What are you doing? What are you doing in your dreams? Can I come rescue you? As long as you have my agent tea available and a flask, I'm there. Also, I recently heard someone ask, what does it say about psychiatrists that Dr. Loomis shot Michael six times? I did shoot you six times. And Michael still got up and lived. Any thoughts? Where's well, a goddamn animal? And obviously he's been juicing. Steroids. That's what he's been doing. If you, if you saw his nipples, the areolas are all off. Michael, it's true. You gotta stop that shit. It's bad for you. You stick with... Blue's Clues and Golden Treats of Goldfish. Here's a question for you, Michael. There's nothing up there, Michael, except no dreams for you. Michael, do you ever get tired of Dr. Loomis yelling at you all the time? He does it. He loves it. What kind of question is that, Diane? I might have to shake him till his head falls off. Because I cannot stand being yelled at too much. So she doesn't like it. But with your Michael Myers, you see how he acts? You have to pull baby back sometimes and smack him in the face and say you're getting too wild. You must stop. That's it. Unsolved mystery done. Marathon over. You see? Don't. Ugh, Michael, look over there. Also, I was wondering, again, for you, Michael, if you had been sent to jail instead of Swiss Grove, would you become a serial killer, or would you have simply stopped with your sister? Explain. Very rousing, Michael. Very rousing. It touches hearts across no one. What do you mean? He would have got tattoos and still fuck people up. Michael, put that scissor. You have not got your permit. Michael's learning how to crochet. Michael shows what he would learn in prison, jacking off. And enjoy the candy and tea, the both of you. And Michael, stop trying to kill Dr. Loomis. I'm not gonna read the last part, but I will because Dirty Diane says so. You're not Dirty Diane, I like you a lot. That's a Michael Jackson song again, I explained this. How about giving him a hug for me instead since I am not there to do it myself? Much love, Diane. Don't you do it. No, no. No. We don't hug in this household. We shake hands. You shake hands? And then, okay, you're too slow. I don't care anymore. So let's open these gifts. To my, this is from you. 
Michael, this has severely affected your goddamn. Get off! You're done. You're not even getting one dollar this week for your allowance. Stop my goddamn head. It hurts. There, this is for you. You open. Go ahead, Michael. You do it. Show them the goddamn wrapping paper. Yeah, okay, what do you get? Oh, a very nice treat indeed. This is what I gave Michael after he tried to kill his niece the first time. No, you, that's what Michael is saying, thank you. He grabs it by the throat and brings it into his chest and clutches it deep to his wiener. Yay, he wins. Okay, stop. Let's see what Dr. Loomis got. You know, there's times in a life that you get something you need and you want and you feel completed. And this is one of those times. I got the Bingo Spice, the Celestial Seasoning, herbal tea, caffeine free. It's okay, I'll work with it. Enjoy! Yo, that's not your tea. Michael's gone because he's disappointed. He's gonna go get a Lego to stick up his butt, I'm sure. And I gotta deal with that. Thank you so much, Diane. I love Bingo Spice. I don't like the team, but I like the spice. No, Michael, you are not the... Oh, you, what are you saying? Oh, going together, yes, now he knows. You don't give them my secrets. I will enjoy this Asian tea over a warm cup of coffee. After. I don't drink vodka. No, no! You might have had enough fucking cocaine! <clears throat> Your fingers smell like armpits. I want to point this out. Anyway, Diane, thank you so much what you've done. Michael's trying out for Chile next week. It's going to be great. Jason is looking forward to it. You are a wonderful person. I appreciate you being a sycophant even though I don't. I think it's terrible that you encourage this type of behavior. But thank you. I will enjoy this herbal tea and we will definitely have a good time while Michael is locked up in a jail cell where I can't look at his ass. Thank you. Okay, so we're ready with this. If Michael gets out of control, I will stop him by inducing this through his anus. Yeah, they know what it is. Look, look at the green shit. It's Gatorade mixed with goddamn Thorazine. He's gonna love it. Michael, it's spilling everywhere. I hope I don't get sick off this. Oh, you wanna have... Oh, damn, it smells like shit! Yeah, you drink that. All right. So, moving through the Halloween trailers. We are now on Halloween 6. Michael, stop it, you're not Prince. Halloween 6, the curse of Michael Myers. And God damn it, it's right. Michael's a curse to everything. Myself, Haddonfield, Laurie Strode, Jamie, and goddamn Old Spice Glow, because it doesn't work. Michael, you can click. We were going to watch Halloween 6, The Curse of Michael Myers. What? Yes, I know, how to, I know how to count. You don't know how to count. Three? What? Are you the... Oh, he wants to do it. Okay. You want to suck a dick? What are you doing? You want to fuck one? Play a guitar while you do it, while you put it in your mouth. And have sex. Hey, yeah, Michael, you have dreams. What? Michael loves piano. I don't know what you're saying. Suck dick. Fuck it. I see what you're doing now, yes. 
Yes! Fuck your ass! No, I don't. Sucking and fucking and touching like those assholes say! Every legend is based on fact. Not always so! Every myth is grounded That's a lie. in truth. Look at Dick Tracy. Get off. For 17 years, the town of Haddonfield, Illinois, has been haunted by a night when evil roamed the streets. Get! And a madman ruled the night. Everyone oh, knows his name. Now, everyone will know the truth. I knew what he was, but I never yes, knew you did. why. Dance. Halloween since the origin That's of not the origin. Myers. What is that shit? It was the curse of Michael Myers. You're the origin. I don't care about where you were from. You were from the devil's state. Excuse me. My phone is ringing. Rihanna's hitting me up on the text. I just got done leaving hickeys on her neck. Okay, it wasn't Rihanna, it was my mother-in-law. Ex-mother-in-law, piece of shit, bitch. So, Halloween 6, the curse of Michael Myers. He's doing sign language, I suppose. He's talking about walking through a forest, finding Jason, and maybe reconnecting through love letters. You will, we will use this later, I promise you this. All this is, is liquidated slushies. It won't even do anything to you, you'll love it. You will love it! All right. So thank you for checking out my, oh uh, my God, Michael, what are you? Michael was falling in love with religion, I suppose, right there. He listened to R.E.M. last night, losing his religion. Just fuck it. We'll be on to the next video. We'll see you soon. Get back. Get back. DDT. Oh, yeah, like resurrection. You. Now how you feel about what you just did? How you feel? Huh? I missed it, but I meant to! Get on my face! You're mowing the lawn in November! Oh shit, Michael. I've seen cocktail!